Hi, my name is Mark Byers. I'm the owner of Byers Scientific and Manufacturing. We're an industrial odor management company and we have a big focus on odor control here in Carpinteria Valley. Let me describe just real quickly uh, essentially what we're doing. This is a tote of the neutralizer. The neutralizer is formulated specifically to counteract cannabis terpenes. This is the odor unit. So the odor unit basically is taking our technology, taking the liquid deodorizer, putting it into its gas state and delivering it all around the greenhouse. An interesting observation is that uh, in speaking with people in a neighborhood um, adjacent to one of the growers, uh, we learned that after the installation, uh, they were, because odor had been uh, effectively neutralized, they were under the impression that the grower had ceased to grow cannabis. So let's talk about odor neutralization. Odor neutralization, whether it's happening under your sink and you spray something on your uh, garbage can or in a mass scale like this, it's all predicated on physical contact. A neutralizer has to come into physical contact with a malodor for it to be truly neutralizing. This is because odors are in their gaseous state. Odors essentially surf the airstream. So what we do is using this pipe, we encircle completely the greenhouse. The pipe has holes in it from which the vapor uh, is released into the airstream and it's released with a bit of force. So the point of that is whether wind is coming onshore or offshore, the first thing that the wind is going to hit is the vapor. It's a virtual vapor curtain all the way around. And since we said that odor surf, the vapor is going to start surfing the same air streams as the odor. That's where the mix begins and that's where neutralization occurs. The foundation of our firm is uh, based on two principles, safety and efficacy. We've discussed the efficacy part here. Part here. Let's talk about safety. The odor neutralizers are plant oils and reverse osmosis water. You can just call it water. There are simply no uh, dangerous elements in it whatsoever. Quite frankly, you could drink the stuff. Um, further to that, it's been tested to EPA standards and then additionally by our own firm using a third party scientific research and consulting firm who also works for the largest waste management company in the world has tested it for public health and safety and acute inhalation toxicity and the results come out to be uh, considerably below any threshold, safety threshold uh, criteria. Uh, it couldn't really be any safer. The local farmers, our customers throughout the valley, uh, have proactively embraced this technology, um, again, preemptively. Um, it's not an inexpensive undertaking, and the technology has been certified by the largest environmental engineering firm in the United States to be the best technology available.